Great. Well, we're here tonight with Corey Epstein. What's the name of your startup? Uh, 20 Jeans. Fabulous. And are you going to speak to some VCs tonight? I'm looking forward to it. Fabulous. Fabulous. Um, what do you want to know? Uh, we're just trying to learn a little bit more about where we need to put our company, where do we need to target um, for our next series of fun fundraising, uh, what are the targets, What's what are they seeing in the market? And you're from Los Angeles, right? Yep. So what, what's it like down in Los Angeles? Uh, LA is great. Uh, Nice and warm. Um, no, it's a uh, it's a it's a bustling uh, scene of startups, and it's really nice to see my home turn into kind of the new Silicon Valley uh, or their little ugly stepchild. Um, but you know, LA is a great scene. Uh, I've seen a bunch of startups from Los Angeles, and uh, it's good to be here, close proximity to the Bay Area, so we can get to meet with uh, these great firms. Thank you so much for your time tonight. Thank you. Hi, Tonya. I see you've come tonight to speak to some VCs. Uh, tell me what the name of your startup. Uh, the name of the company is Read and Rhyme, and we are a digital media learning and technology company focusing on children two to eight years old. And so we're really reinventing the co-play model, as well as modernizing the Montessori curriculum and engaging parents through an analytics platform, which gives back scientific information based on the information that their children uh, play with online. What do you hope to gain from tonight? Uh, well, we're trying to raise our, our first round of financing, so we hope to be able to get um, at least some yeses for a, a next step in conversations with some of the VCs. I hope you get lots of yeses then. I hope so too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Scott. Uh, I hear you're participating tonight as a startup, or you're not a startup. That we're actually approaching our 10th year anniversary. I run an organization called Education Pioneers that brings more leadership and management talent into the education sector. And what are you hoping to gain from tonight? Well, so much of the momentum we've gained in our first 10 years has come from the great advice and guidance we've gotten from uh, venture capitalists and other supporters. And so I'm looking to interface with some really smart people to share with them some of the big challenges and opportunities that we're facing and, and get their advice. Fabulous. Well, I hope you get lots of smart advice, which I'm sure you will because there's lots of smart people here tonight. I'm sure we will too and very much looking forward to it. Thank you. Hi, Robert. Um, I hear that you're going to be uh, contributing tonight to some of the entrepreneurs. Uh, what is it that you think that you can advise them on? The entrepreneurs? Well, to uh, look for help when uh, they need help. So uh, we at Shell Technology Ventures, we're looking for new ideas. Um, and in addition to actually providing uh, capital, we also can help on uh, their innovation and uh, development activities. Yeah, really good mentors then, I would imagine. Yes, so within Shell, we have about a thousand R&D staff um, and subject matter experts from a, a variety of fields, from uh, seismic, uh, IT, uh, downstream technologies, materials and corrosion. So what we help is for small companies who have a bright idea to tap into our resources and help them to um, uh, you know, overcome uh, obstacles. Thank you so much for your contribution tonight. I'm very thrilled to have met you. All right, thank, thank you. you very much. Welcome, Michael, all the way from Cincinnati. Oh my God! And so, what's the name of your startup? We are Pin Gauge. We are a Pinterest marketing optimization solution for large brands. And what do you hope to gain from the mentors here tonight? We're, we're really looking to start building relationships towards our Series A. We just closed our seed round actually this week, um, and starting to build those long-term relationships so that when we're ready to raise a Series A. Uh, we've already had those existing conversations um, instead of starting right when uh, we need the, the funding. And what's it like over in Cincinnati? Is it a bit of a wasteland or is it thriving ecosystem? It's it's actually a, a up and coming startup uh, location. Woohoo! <laughs> so I originally went to Cincinnati to join the Brandery, which is a very great startup accelerator there. Um, ranked in the top 10 in the nation now. Um, and just in my class, which is a year and a half ago, uh, three or four of the startups have now raised very significant Series A's, um, which is unique in a city like Cincinnati. Um, we're next. 
So cool. Well, look, I really hope you get a lot of great advice tonight and maybe some potential funding. Perfect. Thank you so much for uh, putting this together. We appreciate it. Thank you. Oh my God, we've got two guys all the way from Greece. Welcome, Dimitri. Thank you. And welcome, Chris. Thank you. And tell me what you guys were hoping to get out of tonight's session. Well, uh, we're here in the States for uh, fundraising for our startup, for Mist.io, which is for managing servers across clouds using smartphones or tablets. So we're part of Mozilla's Web Forward Accelerator program, and we also got invited here in Vert Venturescape. Fabulous. And um, is there any particular VCs you want to meet? Okay. Well, we would like to meet the True Ventures, which uh, hopefully is the VC that we got matched up uh, by the organization here. So, yeah, that would be awesome. They're a great VC firm yeah. and some great VCs there. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> Thank you so much and Thank all the you. best. Welcome, John. You're all the way from Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, that's correct. I just flew in uh, this weekend. And you got one of those free American flights. Yes, thanks to American. That was great. How did you do that? Uh, one of my sponsors submitted my name. What a great sponsor. And what are you hoping to gain from tonight? Uh, we just closed out a $1.4 million angel investment round, and we're looking to uh, get some insight on how to move forward with venture capital a year down the road. What's the name of your startup and what do you do? Our startup is Intelligent Mobile Support and we connect a mobile workforce like sales and service to experts and in information back at their company to deliver better service. I wish you all the best. I hope you get some really good connections tonight. Thanks very much. Well, we've got a leader here from American Airlines. Oh my God, I'm like so jealous of all these startups that have got free tickets. What, 75 tickets, right? 85. 85, oh my God, you guys were really generous. Tell me about like, your program with the startups. Sure, American Airlines has a program called Innovators Initiative, where we support select startups in a variety of ways to help them grow their company. And our hope is that they'll continue flying on American in the future. Um, so we do travel grants, like today, with 85 companies coming to VentureScape to meet with VCs. Um, we also do marketing. So the, in the American Way magazine, every month we feature a startup. They have a complete editorial write-up on their company, um, and that reaches 4.5 million people. And then we do connections. We connect startups to departments within American, our customers, and our employees. You're doing some great work for the ecosystem. Thank you so much. Thank you. Samantha, welcome. And uh, I hear that you guys come from Ohio, and it seems to be a lot of people from Ohio. And I was wondering if you could tell me a little bit about what your contribution is to the entrepreneurs here tonight. There certainly are a lot of people from Ohio. Just in this office hours today, there are 18 companies from Ohio. Something like 15%. Oh my God. Yeah, 15% of the companies that are here are from Ohio today. Wow. And I work for Jumpstart. Jumpstart uh, invests in and provides technical assistance to entrepreneurs. We have an uh, early seed stage fund, and we have invested in 72 companies to the tune of $27 million. Very good. And are you actually advising tonight, or are you just helping the advisors? So we do have two people. Our president and CEO is on the board of NBCA. And so we have a table here where we are talking to Ohio companies that are not in our portfolio. But we are also learning uh, as we go along, just like everyone else. Fabulous. Well, I wish you all the best. I hope you have some fun tonight, too, when the band plays. There is so much energy here, I can't imagine we're not going to have a good time. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, Steve, welcome. You've come all the way from Atlanta. Did you get one of the free flights from American? No, I, I did not. I actually moved here about three months ago. So I'm, I'm new, new to the city, but I'm, I'm actually locally based right now. And you're here tonight to get some advice from VCs? I, I am. I am. I'm, I'm very excited. It's a lot of really smart folks over here, so hope I can get some good insights. And what's the startup and what do you do? So my company's called Distrib, D-I-S-T-R-I-B-B, and we stand at the intersection of advertising technology and education. We're helping great, uh, high, high quality premium educational content creators get their products out to more people. So we, um, we, put, we put like great content in front of um, like related blogs and related web publishers across the web. Well, I hope you get lots of great advice and maybe some potential funding tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. S same here, same here. I mean, we're, we're really more interested in just getting, getting really good insights and good advice, but if the funding comes along, of course, that can't hurt. Good luck. All right, thank you. 
Welcome, Reed. So I guess you're here to for all the way from Detroit. Yes. Michigan. Yes. Oh my God. The that's where they used to make the cars, isn't it? Yes, they make a few there. Not as many as they used to. And uh, what's your startup? My startup's called Are You a Human? So we use quick, simple games to replace CAPTCHA, um, which is a verification tool that websites will use to make sure they're interacting with real people. They're obnoxious, people hate them, they cause drop off on websites. We have you play a really quick game instead. It's a much better tool. More fun. Yes, absolutely. And what are you hoping to get from tonight? Um, so for us, it's a great opportunity to, one, come to the city, because we're not from here, um, have meetings with potential um, customers and websites that would use us, and then talk to as many VCs as we can, get different perspective. Um, people who don't have a day-to-day -day view of our business, it's really valuable to get those insights. So I hope you get some really great information and some good contacts tonight. Great. Thank you. Thanks very much.